five, four, three, two, one. Goodbye. <laughs> That's cool oh, yeah. every time. So first what we got to do is get the stuff. So outfitting. So it is going to be in uh, utility mounts, correct? Yes. Okay, and that's going to be pulse wave analyzer. Oh my god, it's a million. I only have 48 million. Um, so pulse wave analyzer, and we need some, some asteroid bombs, right? Uh, you want a seismic charge launcher. That'll be in the hard points. You and your fan. I, I said, that's what I said. I said asteroid bomb. It's literally exactly what I said. Uh, Barajian subserp. Nope, nope, nope. Seismic charge launcher. 2B. Yeah, that sounds good. And the other one you wanted was the... What, what was it? Abrasion blaster. Abrasion blaster, yes. All right, so we got abrasion blaster, subsurface displacement missile, and seismic charge launcher, and uh, the pulse wave uh, something analyzer. I was like, you were like, elite dangerous, and I was like, yes, go on. <laughs> got your limpets? Shit. All right, limpets. Yeah, I mean, I had limpets, but I wasn't maxed, so. Wait, observe star probe filter in docking quest. No fire zone left. Take this. Damn you. A R I M A, Arima. On approach vector now. Just gonna go as fast as I can right at your wing signal. Because that's one thing you can do with these rings that I like. Uh... Oh yeah, it penalizes me, doesn't it, when I do that? Yep, I always forget. And uh, the pirate that you brought in when you uh, jumped into the ring, let's just let him scan us so he'll get off our backs. Okay. Oh no, that's that looks like it's another uh, miner. He's in an adder. About that, I don't have a prospector limpet. <laughs> oh boy. Um, I think you could, if I remember correctly, you could lock on the mine. Tell me you have a refinery. <laughs> no. Okay, got the refinery back. Prospector limpet, okay, collector limpet controller, and refinery. Mm-hmm. Did you want to grab the surface scanner while you're at it? Detailed surface scanner, correct? Yes. There we go. Just a random placer. Uh, yeah, in the outer ring. See how there's a gap between inner and outer ring? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I can we actually got. see you firing it. That's I didn't. I've never seen that before. Oh, that's cool. Fleet. All right, got some hot spots. Okay, I'm right over avoidable hot spot, and I'm diving in. Okay, and if the it, the brighter it is from further away, the better it is. Uh, that's the idea. Although there's um, there's some. Um, discussion about how true that is hmm all right well i'll just go to this one this one seems it's kind of far but it's like it's like really glowing more than the rest Ooh, no this this one right next to me that i'm pointed at is a good candidate are we gonna do the same one? Oh, well i want i want to make sure that you're looking roger okay i'm coming over to you so this is the sort of the kind of popcorn slash Depending on what angle you're looking at, it might look like a popcorn or it looks like a pumpkin sometimes. Hmm. There it is. Okay, yeah, I see this, so let's fire the prospector. Programming limpet drone. Prospector limpet failed. Why did it fail? The other one failed. Oh, right. Okay, yeah, now I see these these things 
now I see the hexagons, yes. Okay. Interesting that you that we didn't share the last one. Okay. And hydrogen so, peroxide. Okay. So you see how it the the symbol is the uh, hexagon and it has that curve with a dot on top? Yeah. That's a surface deposit. You want to activate your abrasion blaster and blast it like a shotgun. Okay, so we got hydro limpet or hydrogen peroxide. Did I did I get it? Well, let's just fire a limpet and find out, I guess. But the nice thing is the um, stuff that you blast off the surface, it gives you a much larger chunk of the refined than the uh, yeah than the fragments. Okay. This one's got one, two, three. Um, this one has oh, a fish, fissure. It has a fissure over there? Yeah. Okay, so you want to get your um, seismic charge thing ready. And here's yeah, what you out. do. So there's a bunch of fissures. You're going to... The idea is you need to plant the right number of seismic charges in there to blow it up without blasting the smithereens. On the process at the bottom in blue, it says core detected void opal. Ooh, nice. I've heard of these, yeah. All those um, lock onable parts that have the little zigzag in them, those are mm -hmm. all fissures. So lock onto one of them and tell me what the strength is. Uh, average strength. Okay. So the strength of the fissure represents how much resistance there is to your seismic charges. Okay. You'll see a little, you'll see a little graph come up when you launch your first seismic charge into the fissure. And the idea is to get it into like the blue zone. So for the first one, it's always fun. So for the seismic charges, you want to hold the button until the it charges all the way up and then release it to launch into the fissure. It's charged, firing. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this is cool. Yeah, now lock onto another fissure. And uh -huh. you want to put another charge into it. Detonation you have like yield. A two minute down timer, I think. Yeah, I see that. Nope. Come back. Alright. So, how many do we need? Uh, like four. Okay, here's the. Want to do a medium one on this? Yeah, that's what. Crap. All right, there we go. And we're out. So yeah, back up like a kilometer. Oh, a kilometer. Oh, jeez. Oh, I want to see it. No. Detonation failed. One resource chunk freed. Ah, uh, I see. So it's like Armageddon. A little bit. You want to make sure to not use too many weak ones, because that could, uh, Mm -hmm. You can run out of fissures. Oh, I see. Yeah, it just seems to me like practice. Okay, in the optimum yield range, I'll back up to where you are. Oh, am I about? I'm. Am I good enough? Uh. Oh yeah, you're. Yeah. I went to contact. Three, to try to... two, one. That is freaking awesome. Be you know what, they'll, they're pulse waving and remember the popcorn shape? And it's a very specific popcorn shape. Like there's some that like are close, but not quite. Mm -hmm. But you'll, you'll get the eye for it eventually. You're, you're saying it has a lot of ridges. It's not flat looking, right? Right. It's, okay. it's sort of roundish, but bumpy. Yeah. Bumpy. This is, this is pretty bumpster. It all, I mean, some people say it looks like a little pumpkin from one angle. A pumpkin, okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, this this looks like this has fissures. Found uh, one. Oh, nice. I think. Uh, I think I found one. Yes, I got one too. Yeah. Okay. Optimum yield range exceeded. Yield forecast poor. 
I okay, fired so here's one. A, your contacts page and highlight the fisher that has the charge on it and hit deactivate. Deactivate? Yeah. Oh, then we can start again. Uh, disarm charge. Disarmed. So then do softer then. Yeah. All right, here we go. Okay, we're yellow, yellow and blue. Okay, so just um. That's it. That's all we need, right? It's good to detonate. Um, it says, it says, op it says optimum yield range. Oh, yeah, that looks good. Okay. Let's back her up. Detonation in ten seconds. Oh, in ten seconds. Imminent mining detonation detected. Yeah. So Alrighty. whatever when you hit that name now, whatever timer it goes on to, it's usually in seconds. So rad. Alrighty. Now we're in the money. I mean, I don't know how much one asteroid is worth, but I'm guessing it's not chump change. No. Nope. And just a uh, heads up, I sometimes right when mm -hmm. the thing blows up, the uh, charge level, it looks like it's going to the red. And it's mm -hmm. like, oh no, you overdid it. But uh, I think that's just from the explosion itself. It doesn't actually okay. affect your, your yield. Got it. Detonating. Oh yeah. No, it tells me to. Oh, it does? It tells you as mm -hmm. well? Imminent detonation detected. This is so... It's pretty awesome, like, every time. Yeah, this one is spinning like a butthead. Um, Stop it's moving! Always, it's best to, like, spin opposite of it if you want to, like, get back to a certain fissure. The wrong thing. Uh, I don't like the time. The time makes me hella nervous. And that's understandable. Yeah, your first few times are going to be, like... Going right up there against the edge, but pretty soon it's gonna be like, oh yeah, I can do this in 30 seconds, and then, uh. Yeah, no, it's. Like 80 seconds. How much damage will it do to your ship, by the way? Uh, it depends on how close you are. It's It doesn't say, it just says detonation yield and it's like peeking into the blue. Yeah, no, peeking into the blue isn't quite enough. It has to sort of be. Dang it, I'm um, gonna. I'm not gonna get it. 20 seconds. All right, fortune favors the bold. Dang it. Yield forecast poor. Oh, get out of there. <laughs> Dang it, if I just would've hit it with a Two resource chunks free, is that even worth it, or...? I mean, grab them, yes, but that's... If I would've just hit that last one with a medium blast... Did, did, now, it didn't blow up and crack all the way, did it? Yeah. It, it cracked? Yeah. Okay. And, well, there, there might still be uh, a abrasion blaster one to get off. We just done well, a, I mean, it's it's besides, the, besides mining. Yeah, it's because, like, the, the missions, they're great for upping rank, but they're not great for upping... Which one are you aiming at? This, this, one right, I'm, this, this one right here. It's a tough asteroid, man. I can't even hit it with the seismic charges. Uh, I should switch weapons. Let's try this one I, out. I'm gonna like instantly just dump a bunch of <laughs> seismic charges into this thing and blow it up while you're right next to it. <laughs> you're right next to it too. I can back up faster. Okay. This one's not spinning at all. Yeah, that's, that makes it a lot easier. Okay, so my question is, with a low strength, low strength fissure, you want to hit it with yeah. a big blast or a small blast? So the low strength fissure means that whatever you hit it with, it's going to move the chart a lot more than a high strength. So that, I mean, you had that one really weird asteroid that went instantly into the red. I've never seen that before, but most asteroids aren't like that. Got it. Um, even in on the first one, if it's a high strength blast into a low strength fissure, it mm -hmm. just it'll bump the chart up a bit, but it shouldn't max it out. All right, here's going to be a big blast. Detonation yield in the yellow. Mm. 
firing. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think it just needs a little, little bit of, uh, a little bit of love. All right, I'm gonna do optimum yield range, baby. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Cool oh, yeah. every time. It's probably one of the coolest things I've ever seen in this game. All right, we had to get that. Sorry, did you say sell those diamonds or keep them? I sell everything. Okay. Even the water. Uh, I, yeah, I, uh, I I I dumped that a long time ago. We got four hundred five hundred forty-six thousand. For the grandier, right? Low temperature diamonds, one million two hundred and thirteen hundred thousand, or however you say that number. And the void opals, twenty-two or twenty-three million. Nice. All right, well, that's gonna be it for this stream. Thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, until next time, I'm an unlikely hero. Um, we're going to see you next on Wednesday. Uh, 3 o'clock, we're going to be doing Stranded Deep. Um, and then f f I'm going to be thinking about it, but I'm also going to be on Friday. I don't know what I'm going to play quite yet. I'm thinking it's going to be a little bit of a later stream and probably play a scary game. Uh, so we'll see. All right, peace.